Hi, this is Gareth Kentish and today's video is to show you how to generate further silent revenues by using Google AdSense. Now before you go any further when using Google AdSense, two very important things to note. Firstly, never click on your own ads and secondly, never place these ads into eBay or Amazon or a similar site. Now, once you've set up your Google AdSense account, and you can find Google AdSense quite easily just by typing in Google AdSense in Google, you will find a screen very similar to what you see here. And this particular screen, I've created four previous ads running down here, and I now wish to add another ad. So I just click on the new ad unit here. I'll type in the name of the ad and I'll call it Cycle Customer, like so. I can then decide on the size of the ad. In fact, I'll create a skyscraper and I will stick with my theme of online retail and sports. And then if I wish to stick with the Google default, I'll just stick with that one here save and get code at the bottom I then get presented with the script I then press the left hand side of the mouse moving the mouse downwards highlighting the code in blue I then press Control C which will record that code into computer memory I can then go over to my website and add that code onto a new page where the Google ad will appear. Probably take between 12 and 24 hours for that ad to find its way to your website. But just to give you an example, I'll create a new page. For ex I'll put in Google ad just for the purpose of this exercise. I then click on the text option here. Control V. Putting the script into the page press publish click view page and what will invariably happen in probably 12 to 24 hours the ad will then appear on that page now just to give you an example you can see here that in this particular blog I do have ads now in this particular theme it's working slightly differently because all that's needed is the Google publisher ID now that's located if I just show you going back to my account at the top hand side of the screen here and you can see my publisher ID number there so when you're using a WordPress theme it's very easy because all you need to do if you go into the dashboard go into your theme invariably and I'm using flexibility 3 you'll find that there is a facility to record your AdSense publisher ID and in this case it's here press update and those ads will then appear automatically onto your uh, blog site and it's as easy as that I hope this has been helpful my name's Gareth Kentish and thanks again for watching